Welcome back heroes to some more Super Pokemon Eevee edition. Last episode we managed to activate night mode and now that we're back in Farious Town we can go take on the fourth gym so let's go and start by doing that. Hey how's it going? Hey champ, Jasmine's finally returned. She uses its steel type Pokemon. Lots of types are not very effective against steel so you have to be cautious. Fire, fighting and ground types are the only moves that are super effective so those would be the best choices. Okie dokie so I probably should do this. If I go and team switch, switch Pidgeotto for our Tyrogue, and then I go and change my Eevee into Flareon. All right, let's go do this. So Jasmine's finally back. Ooh, we got triple Magnemite, okay. So fire Fang and just tackle. Magnitude! Magnitude's gonna be really good. And then Karate Chop. Yeah, look at that damage, so good. All right, this could actually be quite an easy battle for us. Or we could get just absolutely joked and then just <laughs> end up losing. We'll see, we'll see. All right. Oh, Tyrogs evolving. Into... Hitmonchan, nice. Okay. So a battle between offense and defense is key. Oh, oh you got a Caesar. That's gonna be really oh level 42. It's a little scary, but at the same time, you will probably just get absolutely deleted by a fire thing, so. Yeah, it's not bad damage. I'm probably have to go heal up before we take on Jasmine though, because oh my god, you're doing so much damage to uh hit one chan. We've got the burn on Sizzle. And the sprite looks so cool as well. Oh, I love that. But if we get Rock Smash this episode, there is so much, so much we need to do. All right, uh, I'm gonna get healed up now because obviously we lost uh, Hitmonchan and Hitmonchan's actually kind of decent to use. But yeah, if we get uh, Rock Smash, if I remember correctly, we can go north to the Berry Patch, get a Bulbasaur, go to Route 10, get that Pokemon, whatever it was, and then keep going south down to the top of uh, was it Ros Lake? Then we can get a Squirtle. And there's also more we can explore with Rock Smash. Other places which I, I can go check out later on. But yeah, it's a lot to do. So still Pokemon are masters at defense. Okay. Oh wow, the, the Fortress colors actually really pop. That looks really cool. Wait, look at the double kick. I forgot Bailey's got that. That's actually gonna be really nice. Let's go for a Rock Throw. Alright, next turn we should win, so that was about half damage, and if we go double kick. Nice! Woo! Okay. This is gonna be real good for us. Could this be the easiest gym? Hey oh! So steel types only came to be a few years ago. Mm-hmm. And you're still yet to discover fairy type at the moment. Fire Fang, Bullet Seed. Karate Chop and Magnitude. Yeah, boy, look at that. Oh, so good. All right, see him again. Fire Fang. Uh, let's go. Oh, I'm going to go for Double Kick, but it's fine. Magnitude. Sweet. Yeah, we got plenty of PP, HP. We got this. Go straight for Jasmine. I ain't, I ain't scared. I think I'm... Um, oh, 120 Pokedex entries. Sweet. Oh, hello. My name is Jasmine. Do you know about the Steel type? They're very hard, cold, sharp, and really strong. You don't really look like the hard type, no offense. Oh, I have a soft exterior, but my soul is as hard as titanium. My father was an iron miner, or my mother, a wielder. You could say, metal is in my blood. Okay, I'll give you that one. Are you ready to battle? Let's dance. Let's do this. Oh, okay, All right, so. Gonna hit you with the fire fang. Gonna go for a reflect first. Karate Chop the Magnemite. I love Steelix's sprite as well, it looks so cool. And then Magnitude. Ooh, that did zero to Steelix, excellent missed. All right, double kick. Karate Chop. Oh, why are we not doing damage to Steelix? This is not looking too good for us. Oh, this is actually kind of scary. What's going on? Okay, let's just take out this Skarmory first. Okay, almost there, almost there. 
Okay, now the Steelix. Can we actually hit it? I'll do a little bit of damage, okay. Zero there, I don't know what's going on. Double kick. Okay, this is... I'm gonna try a... different attack. Uh... It's not bad. Uh... I guess let's go for that. Fire Fang's doing work, so... Why not try Magical Leaf? Oh, Magical Leaf does a lot more. Let's go for that. Oh, we're getting very low. Right, it's going to keep throwing what we got right now. It's slowly doing work. Yeah, Magical Leaf is definitely the play. Oh, we've got no more of that. So, Tackle. Oof. Tackle. Doing zero damage. Someone just kill it. Oh, man. Bayleaf kind of came in clutch at the end there. Oh, man. That was hard. Why is there no sound? Oh. So you're a better trainer than me. Both skill and kindness. In accordance with league rules, I give you this badge. Got the mineral badge. Oh yeah, four gym badges. Halfway there. Take this too. So good luck in getting the other badges. Way, Pajero up to level 25. Sweet. So the sounds just kind of stopped. I feel like something's going to happen once we leave. No? Uh... Is this supposed to be happening? Got some sound effects, but I'm not sure if this is like a bug or not. I'm gonna save in that slot just in case. So I guess now, uh, let me check the world map. Yes, yeah, so we have to head to Moore's village. So let's just make our way. Uh, that's fine. If we leave and. Still no sounds. Okay, if we get to Moore's Village and it's still there are still no sounds, I'm gonna uh just reset the game. Oh, you weren't here before. Ooh, knocked out, okay. Oh, so that spot I found before. I found a spot and I was thinking there's gotta be like a crowded Pokemon shown at some point. I'm gonna guess it's because there's different times of day they spawn. That's gotta be it, right? Let's go for a rock for I should really switch my Pidgeotto back, because I really do like using it. Oh, you got a good sleep on all my team. That's not cool. Right, defend, defend. Might set up a reflect as well. And oh, defend. Oh, no, defend. Let me defend. All right, Rock Tomb. This knock is actually kind of annoying, man. All right, tackle. So I can really go for with Bayleaf. Defend. Rock Tomb. Oh my god, it's taking my Bayleaf. This is not good. Okay, now I've finally woken up. Uh, let me go... Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, wait, no. I want to go Rock Tomb. I want a Tetra Element. I want to go into Thunder. And I want to go... Oh my god. This knockdown's really scary. It's fine, it's fine. So this is the battle music that came back. Right, I need to go for a something. Okay, I'm going to wait for Jolteon to die. So I don't think Noctowl's going to take out uh, Graveler. Oh, look at that speed, though. Man, how fun of things we get off. Woo! I don't even need it. Let's go. When Jolteon's in the limit. Oh, man, that speed is insane. Okay, got a hoo hoo. Sweet. All right, uh, let me go get healed up. And then we're going to make our way uh, to... Moore's Village. Okay, so I've got to tell you guys something really important. So make sure if that sound glitch happens to you, just um, make sure you be using multiple save files. Something really weird happened to me. I tried saving the game after I healed up and then the game just basically said I had not enough memory to create a stream or something. Then it reset and it deleted my save file. But luckily I had multiple ones. I was like, okay, that was weird. Did it again. And I deleted my second backup. I was like, oh my god, that was so close. I almost lost my whole entire game then. So uh, make sure you just um, save it often. So I've got save. I've got my free again. I'm going to just uh, yeah save it there. Just save it very often because um, things could glitch. And I've also lost the uh, 
Oh, it's because the repels up, that's why. Yeah, there you go. I was about to say, I've lost the um, encounter bit. That's because I had it repel up. Okay, that's good. I thought there was another glitch right there. I was starting to panic going, oh no, man, I've broken the game. The game's going to break. But, yeah, I don't know what happened. But I just lost them. Um, all the sound. I just had a bit... Uh, shut the game down completely. Like, t turn the launcher down. Then launch it back up. And then everything was fine. So just, uh, yeah, be careful. If your game gets no sound, then you need to just... Um, Try and fix that right away. Because that's not supposed to happen. Obviously, as you see it now. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Better it happen to me right now so you guys know. And it won't happen to you, hopefully. Alright. Take you out the area lace. All good. That hoot hoot. That Noctowl. I took out Noctowl probably like four times. No. One, two. Three times. Three times. Oh. Alright. Is it this way we want to go? Nope. want to go this way a bit more. We did pick up a side... Yeah, pick up a side quest from some kid. Got to deliver a letter to- oh, hey you! Ah, <sighs> yes! This way leads to Luna Forest. It's a little dangerous Pokemon. You need at least four gym badges to pass. I've got three badges, so- so close, yet so far. Wait, what?! Oh, okay. I guess my save file was before I battled Jasmine. Alright, uh, let me be back here in a second. Okay, so we're back. Now I've, I've defeated Jasmine again. <laughs> hey you! Yes, this one is the Lunar Forest. I've got my four badges. Here you go. Okay, you have four gym badges. You can go through. Thank you very much. Alright, so let's start making our way through. Is this place any different from when we came through before? I'm gonna assume yes. I want to talk to this kid, actually. Both Solar and Lunar Forest exist in the same place, but they have a completely different layout. Oh, yeah, okay. Right, so let me pop that repel so we can get through here a little bit easier. And see if we can find any new, uh, new corrupted Pokemon to maybe capture. You want to battle? Yes, you do. Finally caught a Houndoom. Been looking for them for ages. Why aren't you the woman looking for a uh, Shroomish? Ooh, might he get on a Houndoom? That's a pretty scary team you got there. Magnitude. Nice, okay. We got this, we got this. Aerial Ace, double kick. Teaching like Bailey double kick was actually so clutch. So good. Alright, Pidgeotto go for some nice Aerial Ace to finish you off and we'll get- Oh, air cut I guess. Uh, tackle. Nice. Okay, not bad. Sweet, sweet, sweet. And we got some money. No, my dog dogs! Unlucky you. Right, so let's grab this. Dog beam, okay. Ooh! What is that? Hound Hour? Ooh, Hound Doom! Okay, so I need to switch into Vaporeon. So we can go for them Bubble Beams. Double Kick. Uh, Rock Tomb. Ooh, Graveler's Poison, which is not good. Aerial Ace and... Oh, flinched. Okay, that's fine. Start spamming them Bubble Beams! Nice, keep it going, keep it going. Oh, we got this in the bag, easy. Kind of tempted to, oh, kind of tempted to, um, put the hound down on the team a little bit. Here's a nice cool hound doom. Oh, dude, ah, I hate being paralyzed. I'm so poisoned and everything. I probably should run back and heal up. Let's just quickly take you out first. And make the most of this repel as well, just see if we can find anything else. Alright, there's a little hound owl, all ours. Way, nice. Super 18, magic card 13. Alright, what else? Uh, oh, we definitely should drink some water. Um, it's been a while since I've seen the night. It's so beautiful. It is, right? Right, let me go around here and push his boulder down first. Oh, there's Silver. He's gonna want to battle, isn't he? Oh, that's not good. Oh no, we've been here, haven't we? Okay, so... Uh, which way do we go? Guess we go this way. Hey, oh! It's been quite some time since I've been to Moore's Village. Wouldn't be surprised that everyone was trying to get there right now. Ooh. Okay, this could be... a bit better. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. It's bubble beam. Just take out one at a time. 
Uh, I'm gonna go heal up very soon. Roller's not actually bad at all. Ooh, man, that poison got 13 HP left. Come on, we can take it out. One HP! Come on, Bayleaf. Oh, you're confused. No! It's fine, it's fine. <laughs> I can't actually live on like one HP though right now. Oh, there you go. It's fine. We win the 1v1. Easy peasy. Alright, you're a good trainer. Ooh, hit one channel with 22. Agility was learned. Sweet. So we need Rock Smash to go that way. Uh, let me just break this tree. No, I don't want to go. Actually, no, I can go down here. Oh, okay, so we're going to get down a second. So if I push this boulder down, got the shortcut. So let me go get healed up. I'll see you guys back here in a second. All right, we're back. Nice and healthy. Let's go and take on this uh, corrupted Pokemon. What is that? Oh, it's a Nuzleaf. Part of me was thinking it like a bit like a Bon Sweet a little bit. I was like, it's definitely not a Bon Sweet. Oh, I should switch into Flareon. Got a nice Fire Fang. Double Kick ya. Nice. Double Kick does so much damage. So good. Keep it going, keep it going. Ooh. You're evolving to Shiftry just the right time. Just to take you out. <laughs> I wonder if you get more experience if they evolve. Alright. Nice. Let's go this way and we got silver to battle. Hey oh. Hey you. Oh hey, long time no see. I let you off last time, but this time we're having a battle. Sounds like a plan. Get ready to lose. For the fourth time? Don't be so sure about that. I've been training my Pokemon a lot. We're starting to become a real solid team. I finally surpassed you. Haha, <laughs> no one makes you think that. Cause I have five gym badges. What, already? Yep, count them. No way! I just got my fourth gym badge. You're slacking, kid. Kid? We're not the same age. I've just been preoccupied with stuff. Whatever you say. Now that I have more gym badges, I'm finally stronger than you. That's not how it works. There's only one way to settle this. You mean a Pokemon battle? Well, well. I like the sound of this. My Pokemon could always use more battle experience. Ooh, okay, let's do this. Ooh. It's got a Sneasel now, it's a 4v4. Let's go Air Cutter. Uh, I'm gonna Fire Fang the Bayleaf. Uh, Magic Leaf the Croconaw. And Rock Tomb the Quilava. Ooh, that's good damage. That is very good. Alright, same again, I think. That should take out the Bayleaf, I think. Oh, I didn't want to attack the... Uh... Oh, wait, it's fine. Worked out, I guess. Air cutter again. Alright, so we're gonna rock throw you. Sweet. Fire Fang the Sneasel. Magical Leaf the Croconaw. Nice. And we've got Air Cutter. I should take out the Qualava and Croconaw. Woo! And then one little Pokemon left. Oh, we got this in the bag, BB. Quick attack. Yeah! <laughs> Woo! Pretty easy. What? How? I have more badges. I evolved my Pokemon. I'm sure I'd beat you this time. You shouldn't be so fast to underestimate me. I suppose you're right. Even though they lost, my Pokemon put up a good fight. I'm becoming a much better trainer. Yeah, we both have. Faultsy, this battle has taught me two things. The amount of gym badges doesn't determine strength. And that this rivalry is far from over. We'll meet again. Okay. Alrighty, oh, oh, hi. There's moonlight pouring through the windows. I just want to start singing Dance in the Moonlight right now. But Moore's Village, let's definitely buy this. Got some pumpkins. It's a jack-o'-lantern. Spooky. So what do we got in here? Hey, oh. So don't you love mining? Can't really say I've mined before. Wait, don't tell me you don't have a pickaxe. Pickaxe? Pickaxe can be used to break rocks. It's an essential tool for every miner. Oh, lucky for you, I give out pickaxes to trainers. Cool. On the small condition that they have at least five gym badges. Oh. Could have mentioned that earlier. <laughs> Alright, so we come back, then we get Rock Smash. Nice. 
This town used to be a mining hotspot years ago. Well, it wasn't until a mine, a mine fire caused the deaths of countless miners. Now the spirits of the miners haunt the mines. The remaining miners moved to the Ferrious Mines. They don't dare disturb the spirits. Well, except my husband. He's still, he's still mine here. Okay. There's a lot of mine there. But these pumpkins may look like jack-o'-lanterns, but they're actually spirit warding idols. They were created by the Sage Master to stop the cave spirits from haunting the town folk. Oh. So I can't believe it. First I lost my lunch, then I lost my favourite earring, and now I lost the keys to my house. Again! You sound awfully forgetful. Your brother gave me a letter to give to you. My brother? Oh, you're right. I do have a brother. The uh, well, here's the letter. <laughs> Thanks, it reads, your spare key is in the pumpkin. But what could that mean? <laughs> There's a key in here. Wait, I think that's mine. That's right, my brother left a spare key in there. Okay. Hi, who are you? Seriously? I delivered your brother's letter for you. Ah, oh, you're right. Thank you for helping me. I can finally sleep in my house tonight. Here's a reward for your efforts. Ooh. Okay, sweet. Alright, what else we got? Oh, uh, can't do the gym just yet. Sorry, but Morty, the gym leader is not here. Why are these leaders never at their gym? Morty went to the cave of the dam to investigate the disturbance. Oh, okay. Sage Master's house. No one here. And we've got the Pokemon Center. Let's get healed up. All good. Alright, nice. And we should definitely save it. All good, alright. Well, I think that's probably a great place to end this part off. Next episode, we'll go to the Cave of the Damned. Probably go take on um, Vanish 23's domain. Probably get the fifth gym badge, get Rock Smash. Next episode is going to probably be quite, quite eventful. So I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Peace.